Mac Taylor's got a new person to report to, and it's everybody's favorite, John LaRoquette, stepping into the role in a multi-episode arc on CSI New York. Neither of us is to utter the word sniper. Is that clear? That's a direct order from Chief Sinclair to me. Now it is a direct order from me to you. Is that going to be a problem? We're glad to have John on the show. It's, uh, it's going to be fun to work with him. We've had a real run of quality guest stars on the show lately, and I'm uh, happy to have him on board as well. I love John. I worked with him on Night Court many years ago. So I have fond memories of working with him. I'm so happy to see him today walking the set. He's awesome. It may be a love fest off camera, but make no mistake, Larroquette's character is all business. He plays Deputy Chief of Detectives Ted Carver, a no-nonsense company guy who immediately rubs Mac Taylor the wrong way. These cases are related. The sooner the people know, the faster they can take steps to protect themselves. It's not your call, all right? And I'm not about to create a citywide panic. And he's more conservative and toes the line more than Gary's character, so they sort of have a tete-a-tete -tete about how to proceed with the case. Uh, we have a... Uh kind of an adversarial relationship. They butt heads. If you were a civilian, would you want to know? Your piece of work, Taylor, you know that? But um, over the course of the, the storyline, I think you, you, they reveal things about themselves that I think are more uh, in sync with each other than not. In the next two episodes, we reveal that this man has a secret, that we discover some dead bodies and wonder where they came from, and uh, history is revealed, and uh, Gary and Ted come to an understanding of each other. I think Gary's character feels empathy and sympathy for this guy, but he has to pay the piper at the end. No, the public has the right to know what we tell them. I'm not going to lie for you or anyone else. Who's anything about lying? Why so much tension between Mac and Carver? I think because Mac is who Mac is, and and my character is a little more by the book and probably acquiesces to the powers that be more than Gary's character does. More of a company man, my character, I think, is really where the conflict comes from. Max, uh, you know, he's a tough guy, uh, does things his way, and uh, sometimes uh, the bosses don't like it. You just stand there, it will all be over in a few minutes, right? Lara Kett says being part of the CSI New York world is a win-win. Yes, because I'm a fan of Gary, so you know, I don't watch a lot of television, especially if I'm on it, but uh, I've, I've followed Gary's career for years, and I think this is a great franchise, and I've watched this show because of him.